Hello viewers, rating of the day. Myself, Sharad Chandra in Goa, would like to present you various definitions of probability through a series of lectures. As a part of lecture series, in this video, I hereby present the definition of classical probability. The classical definition or interpretation of probability is identified with the works of Pierre Simon Laplace. Therefore, I name this classical definition as Laplace classical definition. According to this definition, the probability P of A of any event A is determined a priori without actual experimentation. It is given as the ratio of number of favorable outcomes to the event A to the total number of possible outcomes, provided that all these outcomes are equally likely. In order to understand this particular definition of classical probability, we hereby consider an example. Consider a box with n white balls and m red balls. In this case, there are two elementary outcomes. That is, either selecting a white ball or selecting a red ball. Let us consider an event of selecting a white ball and define its probability. The probability of selecting a white ball according to the classical definition is given by the number of favorable outcomes to this event that is n white balls to the total number of favorable outcomes for this particular experiment is given by n white plus m red balls. Therefore, the probability of selecting a white ball is given as n by n plus m. However, this definition can be applied only to those experiments in which all simple events have equal chances. The word equal chances is synonymous with equal probability. So, to define the probability using classical definition, we consider an experiment in which all the simple outcomes have equal probability, where this is a blunder. Therefore, the classical definition of probability suffers from these kind of limitations. Thank you.